Hello and welcome back everybody. Episode, I want to say this is 25 now, of Extreme Survival. And, whoa, I feel like I've seen all this stuff in here before. But maybe I didn't. I honestly don't recall. Or maybe I saw it, but I didn't grab, I must not have grabbed it. Or maybe I did that off camera. I don't even know. Either way. Hmm. Things are running a little laggy. Which they were doing last time. And I don't know why. Like, the... Whoa, 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 whoa. The door opened quick enough. But the sound took forever. There's definitely something going amok. Okay, well. I got this anvil. And I got this hammer, so I may as well put them out. And... I keep hitting Q instead of W. There we go. Optional storage for your hammer right there. Okay, um, let's go ahead and put the armor on. Oh, wait. Or did I already grab this stuff? And now I just got duplicates of it. You know, I think I may have somehow accidentally duplicated my stuff. Hmm. Peculiar. Most peculiar. Okay, now I could spend more time working down here. But you know what? I don't feel like... Oh, wait, is it dark out? Never mind, I guess that's what we will do. Because I'm not about to go working outside in the dark. It's too dangerous. Just wondering if I have a pickaxe anywhere. Man, this is... This is horrible. I don't understand what is going on here. There never used to be any problems with the server. And suddenly it's just gone super laggy and nobody can figure out why. Uh, here we go. Iron pickaxe. That'll work. Just need to do a bunch of digging down here. Yay for digging. I don't really know how big this needs to be made. But I may as well... Pull it all out to the same size, I guess. The dirt I really should do with the shovel. Just because that is the right tool. And it's always best to use the right tool for the job. And I should take that out as well. So I don't know if I have any of the blocks to fill that in. Oh well. I'm gonna have more than enough stone to make them, so no issues there. Now I am wondering. Okay, I do actually have those cool beans. Um how am I gonna know when it's daytime? That's a problem I have not thought of. Like, I need, I need some system. I'll have to build something with Mesocons. With a Mesocon solar panel. So when it is daylight, I know that, hey, I should uh, exit my underground basement, whatever I want to call this, and go outside and do stuff. Because I have to work on the power tower. The location where these solar panels will be. The batteries. Switching stations. Things like that. I may even put... Ooh, I'm a hardened miner. Nice. I may even put a um, an automatic backup fuel generator. 
which I built on the survival server. And I actually even have a video about that. If you were so inclined and wanted to watch it, you can find it on my channel. Um, but yeah, I have a video and it basically uses Mesocons. Whoa, I don't know what I just dug through there. It basically uses Mesocons and a like a sunlight detector and or wait no 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 what am i thinking that's not what that one does that one is a uh it's a no detector that looks for a battery that is less than fully charged and those actually didn't need to go there and if it finds one it kicks on a Man, I cannot think today. It kicks on uh, an injector that shoots some leaves into a furnace so the leaves can be burnt and create power. And that way you pretty much never have to worry about running out of power. Okay, let me grab out whatever dirt's in here. It's not too much dirt, but I am going to need dirt. All right, we've got an alligator out here. Let's just run, run, run. He hasn't seen me yet. I don't think he's seen me yet. I don't know, maybe he has seen me. I don't even know. All I know is I need to run, run, run. Okay, I need to get up this... this side here. That's too high for me to jump. Alligator? No, I don't think he's following me. Good. I was going to say, if he is... Oh, what is this? Say, if he is, it's going to end badly for him. And I got another achievement? Man, I am just getting the achievements today. Whoa. Oh, cool. It connects... Over here. Interesting. Pretty useless to me, but interesting. So I won't turn my nose at that iron. Um, yep, let's, let's just get out of here. All right, so the plan. I wonder what my elevation is. That's actually probably the better place. Got my axe on me. Chop down these trees. And I will put a solar tower up here. Which... Oh, wow, and I'm a lumberjack too? Man, I am... I'm just everything today. Uh, I really dislike this uneven ground, though. What do I have in the way of dirt? Not much. I've got plenty of stone, though. Tons of stone. Well, I am going to start blocking this in, I guess. Man, this is going to take ages. Oh, boy. Yeah, this is going to take a while. And I can't even reach it. That's horrible. Can't reach. Can't reach. This is like the perfect place to be attacked by some birds. Like, just in, totally in the open air. Totally a horrible place to be in the dark. Let's light it up. Light it up. Okay. So basically, whoa, out of dirt. Man, I 
really don't want to just throw a bunch of cobble down, but you know what? If that's what I got, that's what I'm going to use. Boop, boop, boop. I mean, admittedly, I'm never really going to look at this. So, I guess it doesn't really matter. It might be an eyesore to the to the native population. Um, the native population of birds and what else hangs out over here? I don't know. Dragons, maybe? Have I ever had a dragon here? I think I may have seen a dragon once or twice. Poking his nose around where it didn't belong. Yeah, this looks super ugly. Oh, well. And then I think... Eh, you know what? That's weird. I just heard a sound of something on glass. Huh, whatever. I'm gonna have to put a front... Well, do I really have to? I guess not. I probably should. But from a purely logistical standpoint, I guess there really is no reason why it has to. Has to what, you ask? Oh, have like an, an entryway or a big window or something. Okay. And I think I'm just going to close this off about there. The solar panels and stuff will go higher. There is something moving around here. I don't know what it is. I don't like it. Okay, well. Torch doesn't have to go bye-bye. Um... I'm not really so much worried about anything finding its way in here. But if I can keep anything from just waltzing in on me, you know, it'd probably be a good idea to do. Okay, this is a very dark interior. I don't really like really dark interiors. Oh man, I'm gonna have vines growing down from that ceiling all over the place because it's dirt. Oh well, is what it is. Whoa, that made it really dark. Okay. First things first. Determine what my ground plane will be. Oh, there's an opening. Um, I have no idea what I'm doing here. For some reason, this is going to become too leveled. That wasn't the plan. I'm just going to block that off. And make a solid wall there. Okay, I may leave this as ground level. For chance. Like I said, not really too worried about the looks. This is just going to be a power station, so all that's really going to be here is batteries. That's pretty much it, really. Uh, I might as well block that in, because why not? Put a torch back out. Okay. So we have that. I guess. Oh, I didn't want to put that there. I wanted that there. Just for kicks and giggles, we'll make this a tall edge. 
and that'll basically just keep anything that should happen to spawn in here from being able to jump up. There we go. Now it'll pretty much have to spawn in this area or above it. Now I... Oh wait, no actually... Ah! Werewolf. Good. Good. What does this look like from the front side? <laughs> it looks ugly. That's fine. I don't know if that guy's trying to get me or not. Where are my torches at? I got two of them. Okay, so I will just... I didn't fill that corner in. That is horrible. I'm just going to go ahead and put a torch there. One there. And this guy actually needs to be here. So that's pretty much the top of the area. Solar panels will go up. Uh, I forget which elevation they're supposed to be set at, though. I'll have to refigure that out. Okay. Someplace in the top there, there'll be a hole where the wire will run through. That tree is bugging me, so it'll probably end up getting removed. Totally safe way to get through there. I wonder, do I have any coal? I do have coal on me. Good. I want to get some more lights. Also, I should probably throw a door in. Seeing as how I have a door just chilling on me, may as well put it to use. Put some lights there. Put that one there. Ah, uh, you know what? Let's just block this out. And then take this light, put it there, put one there. All right. Eliminate this little ledge thing. I don't even know why that gravel never fell. Wow. I would dig faster by hand. Or with gravel. I actually wanted to put it there. It's alright though. Okay, let's dig that out. Dig that out. I'm gonna have to put some kind of a stair in or something. I need some way to get up higher. Dig that out. Axe is gonna break soon. I can't reach it! What about this there? Okay, I can reach that. Good, good, good. Okay, now if these vines would have grown deeper, longer, taller, whatever, so I could reach, I could get up. As it stands, I think a ladder will suffice. Should. Yep, how do I build one of these? Sure, give me ten of them. I don't think I have enough to build ten. You know what, though? Eight's enough. Support structure for buildings. Huh? Interesting. Okay. The ladder may as well go here as anywhere, I guess. La 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 la! Okay, now we get up to this little ledge thing here. And may as well light it up. Okay, I think that needs to go over one space. And then that, yep. Okay, so we have this little ledge thing that serves no purpose at all. Other than to exist. I will probably we'll run the wire down someplace. I could fill this up just without batteries, honestly. That'd be a lot of batteries. Could actually also put some geothermal in here. If I ever got to that point. Where I needed a lot of low voltage power. Actually a geothermal could run. Down through this chunk of the cave here. 
without any issue. Okay, well, this is probably lit pretty well. I'm going to go ahead and put a couple torches up there just because. I don't think anything could spawn on a wall. But why risk it? Anything that could spawn down there shouldn't be able to get up. Other than flying things. Or I guess a dragon or dungeon master could shoot me. But I don't think either of them would spawn in here. So, should be okay on that. I do kind of dislike this, though. It's just too easy for someone to walk right off. Try to get to the door and accidentally overwalk it. Um, do I want... Nah, I don't think I'll put any torches in here. That guy is still hanging out down there? Dude, leave, man. Come on. Oh, no. He's probably on my butt now. No, actually, he hasn't even seen me. Ah, oh, what a joke. Good. Good. That's what we need. To get back home in safety. Okay, now. What I need to do... Um, where do I even look? I don't know. I got stuff in too many places. I had letters. I didn't know that. Um, what I need. Why do I have so many iron swords? What do I need to make? To make solar panels. All right, we'll just start with solar. Okay, that's the Mesocon one, which we don't want. This is the low voltage. Okay, I need doped silicone wafers. Glue, wire, low voltage. Doped silicone needs silicone and gold dust, which needs sand and coal dust, which means I need a grinder. Do I have a grinder? Yes, I do. I have a fuel fire generator, LV grinder, cable, and a switching station. All right, so do I have any gold, though? I thought I did one of these bags. Nine gold lumps. Excellent. Okay, let us set this up in the basement. I guess it doesn't really matter where right now. Do that, that. I'm gonna need that. And gonna need some cable. Fuel fire generator. I'll put there. Put a cable there, put that guy there, and put this here. Then I'm going to throw the gold up in there. I don't think the leaves are ever going to make enough power to run this. Nope. However, where did all those leaves go? Wow. Um, I think I can take leaves... Turn them into oil extract. Oil extract, I think, will burn long enough. Where this should be able to run. Yep. Perfect. Okay, so. How do you do leaves? I want to say oil is this. Yep. That gives me 40 more. Now, the only downside to this system is this furnace will burn no matter what. So I really need to put a battery in to save power that's not used. Now, a battery is pretty expensive from what I recall. Low voltage. I need a machine casing and rechargeable battery, which is tin and copper. Of course. Tin, fortunately, I do have a lot of. I don't know why I closed inventory. I don't know about copper, though. Copper ingots, tin ingots. Okay, and I think I needed three, which I don't have enough wood. Why do I keep doing that? I don't have enough wood for right now, but now I do. Okay, so we need three of these. 
And unfortunately, they are not stackable, which has always irked me. I don't understand why they're not. Okay, so we've got those. Oh, I need four. <laughs> One more. Okay, so I've got four of those. I need a machine casing and a low voltage wire. Do I have either of those sitting around someplace? Mm -hmm. Machine casing or low voltage wire. There's no way I only made one piece of low voltage wire. I've got to have it sitting in a chest somewhere. Maybe over here? Whoa. Maybe I... I don't think you can even create... One. Oh, maybe it's in the chest down here. So I don't think you can only create one piece of wire. I think you have to make more than that. Okay, well, I guess I need another piece of wire. Paper and copper. Do I have any paper on me? No, of course I don't. Papyrus. Do I have papyrus? Ah, I got plenty of paper there. Good. And I got a tin lump. Okay, I think we want bag three. To get the copper. One, two, three. Oh. Actually, I didn't have a tin. Oh, tin lumps were in a different bag. That's right. Oh, well, whatever. Okay, let's do one of those. Yeah, that gives you six cables. Oh, I wonder if I had to use them for... Uh, for different machines, that's probably what it was. Okay, now I need brass and cast iron. Do I have either of those? Probably not. Um, yeah, we'll do that. We'll just throw this right there. Throw in this raw iron. Throw in that. I'm going to actually need more raw iron and some brass. And of course I don't have any brass on me. And I honestly don't remember how to make brass. So we'll have to pull that back up. Okay, alloying. Copper and zinc. Do I have any zinc? I have zinc dust. Do I have an alloy furnace? I don't think so. Ah, but I must. Wait a minute, how? Whoa, no, I didn't want to drop the dust. That needs to be cooked. I'm confused now. Go ahead and cook that. How would I have made a machine casing if I didn't have brass? Hmm. It needs brass. I'm so confused. How do you get brass if you can't... Copper and zinc. Can I maybe just do it in the crafts grid? No, because those can only be... Somehow I had to have made an alloy furnace. But I don't understand how I could have. Without a machine casing. I am so confused. How is this possible? Go 
grinders. Oh wait, what about the fuel flared alloy furnace? That's what it is, it's brick. Okay, I could swear I have that though. Didn't I? Here, okay, there we go. It's freaking out. Obviously, you could tell. Okay, so we have that. Um, I don't have any fuel. I'm going to need one of those. Bada bing, bada boom. I hope that's enough. Should be. Okay, and then that'll make a battery. Woohoo! That actually gave me three of them. Good. Okay, so back to the quest for a battery. Uh, low voltage, low voltage. We need this. So there's that. Then I think we have everything else. Ta-da! Uh, can I actually put the battery right there? And then uh, throw some fuel in this. battery box is charging beautiful goody 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 I don't know how much of a charge it's gonna get from the amount I gave it but you know what that's fine um I should probably start a transforming some of these lumps into dusts and then I can cook them up yay we have begun our predecessory introductory I don't know what the correct word is we have begun on our ultimate quest of dominating the world oh wait no of uh, building cool technic machines my bad, I forgot. We're not trying to dominate the world. We're trying to be peaceful, peace loving individuals. Which is why we're playing on the extreme server that's PvP enabled. And I guess I can't get onto my stairs to get out of here. There we go. Alright, well, we are going to end this off. We got some Technic stuff running. We got things started up on the up on the mountain there and yeah we will keep grinding away at this technic stuff pun intended to me grinding the lumps and yeah we'll see how long it takes to finally get things together thanks for watching my video really hope you enjoyed it if you did would you consider giving it a thumbs up I appreciate all those I can get I'm on social media peoples follow me Google+, Plus, Twitter, Facebook. I always post all of my videos on those platforms, or links to my videos on those platforms, as soon as they go live. Which this means prior to the release on YouTube. You can watch them before anybody else. You can also visit my website, NathanSalpat.com, and see all my videos there. A really nice website, if I do say so myself. I did design it, so I might be a little bit biased, but I still think it's it's decent. If there is a mod you would like me to review, just click on the Request a View button right there. It takes a two-form on my website. You just type in the information, hit the Submit button. I get it. I look at it. Record a review. Post it online. You watch. We all profit. The world's a better place. Yeah, I don't know about that last bit, but... Hey, do it anyways. There's, you got nothing to lose. I'll catch you next time.